Oh, I do hope this is okay. Right, multiplayer, yes. Gamepad support, no. Linear, linear story, yep. Okay. Okay, so story and quests should be... Right, so engine should probably be about... Oh, that's interesting. The engine only needs to be about there. Story and questing should be about there. And gameplay can be right there. So this is all we need to focus on. Put a little bit more into there. There's a, apparently the perfect balance. Okay. Well, this could be interesting. Right. Oh, just boogie is not going to make us much, is it? Okay, let's bring this way down. I want a dialogue tree. Dialogue needs to be about there. I want AI companions. So that can go about there. And there can be a level editor. Actually, no, there isn't. Okay, that seems good. So, first fantasy. Let's hope that this game will do okay, because just Boogie is going to lose us a lot. Open world. Day and night cycle, rich backstory, all the works. Okay, where does sound need to be? About there? Graphically, it should be about there. For what we need. Okay, okay. Let's, let's try this. I'm going off the percentages that I'm seeing, so it'll be interesting to see how this works. Oh! The play system too. Okay. Right. It'll be interesting to see how that turns out. Oh, we're losing a lot of money. Let's just finish this bloody game. Come on. Right, a new record there. That leveled up. And that leveled up. And that leveled up. Okay. Release. Oh, bloody hell. Why did you get basic physics and mod support? Okay, well, first things first, I wanted to research multi-genre. Okay. First fantasy. Oh, fucking hell. Why? Adventure was popular. God damn it all. There's going to be another fucking loss, isn't it? How much did we spend? 251k. And it is selling shit all. Eesh. Okay. That sold bugger all as well. I don't even want a booth this year. Okay. Right. So the play system 2. When is that out? Alright, multi-genre. I kind of... I, I think I'll just do some contract work. We can do that. So yes, I'm gonna... I think I'll just... Oh! Oh, really? Micronoft? The M box. Okay. When is... Okay, in the coming months. Alright. I think... There we go. So the play system 2 has been released. Right. Let's start developing a new game for... We'll make it a medium game. It'll be a launch title. Kill... Phone. There we go. It'll be a military action adventure game. Actually, you know what? Yeah, we'll go for a military action adventure game. On the play system too, which is not fucking cheap at all. Oh dear. This could bankrupt us. It'll be mature. Let me think. We'll call it Kill Cone instead. Actually, you know what I want to make? If I can do it. What would it, what would what would you count Grand Theft Auto as? A, um, a city action adventure? Let's make a city action adventure game. Grand Theft 
Walrus. And I can put numbers there, so that's good. Okay. A city action adventure game. This could go really badly and kill the company, or this could be fantastic. Right, let's put me on gameplay. We'll put Joe on the engine, and we'll put Jalen there. Has gamepad support. More story and quests. Bring the engine down to about there. It only needs to be there. Gameplay. How about there? Actually, no. Okay. This could kill the company. And that scares the shit out of me. That really does. Oh. Right. That's... Oh, the Dream Vast is dying. That's not good. Right, we'll put me on... Dialogue. Jill on level design and Jill in there. Let's bring the AI down to about there. Dialogue can go up a bit. Okay. Oh dear. So the M box has been. Yeah, I understand. Microsoft. Microsoft. Sorry, Microsoft. <laughs> yeah, who's Microsoft? Never heard of them. Right. First fantasy did shit. Okay. Hmm. Put me there. Hmm. Let's bring graphics up a bit. Actually, let's try and have stunning graphics. Can we possibly st do, like, stunning everything? You know what? Let's try it. Let's try and just have stunning everything. I don't know if that's how it works, granted. I'm pretty sure it still balances out the amount of time spent, regardless of... Okay, I, I don't know how this will work. Maybe Grand Theft Walrus will be an exciting city action-adventure game. Or it will fail miserably. Okay, a new combo. Not a great combo, though, which is worrying. Okay, surround sound. Invest in new PCs. Fuck it. We'll do it. There we go. New PCs. We're pretty broke. We are, we are pretty broke. Find some contract work. I'm fairly confident we can do this. Alright, Grand Theft Walrus. Oh no! Son of a bitch! Grand Theft Walrus is not bad. It's a fantastic game. It's an open world city action adventure. Oh, we're going to lose money again. I'm running this company into the ground, aren't I? Alright. Alright, since G3. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that sounds like fun. Alright, Grand Theft Walrus sold seven. Oh, it sold fuck all. This is not good. This is very not good. Come on, get the game art finished. No, there's no way we're doing this. Son of a bitch. Finish the fucking game art. Oh, you were so close. Ugh, has Grand Theft Walrus actually made any money? No. It costs so much to make. We've made some pretty shit games recently. Alright, you know what we need to make? You know what we, we need to make? The Welder Scrolls 3. So let's develop a sequel. And this will make or break the company. Alright. The... My keyboard isn't working. There we go. No, bloody hell. Welder Scrolls 3. Okay. We could make medieval RPG adventure. Let's make this on our latest engine. On we'll make it for the PC. 
Okay. It'll be another small game. Let's see if we can get the Welder Scrolls 3. Granted, this isn't as far after the Welder Scrolls 2. This is maybe a year after? So that's a bit worrying. No need for that. Multiplayer? Yes, we'll keep that as a main feature from now on. Do a bit of focus on the engine, bring story and questing back a bit. No real advancements there, bring gameplay down a bit. Actually, keep gameplay there, put story and questing there, put the engine to it there. Okay. You need to go on holiday, fella. Get out of here. Okay. That seems pretty good. Put dialogue down a bit. AI up a bit. Oh, I just want this game to be successful and give us millions. We could sue them. Let's warn them. I don't want a chance losing money in court. Alright, bring sound down a bit. Bring graphics down a bit. Let's have world design as the main feature. Okay, this is looking technologically impressive and the design is impressive. Save to cloud and achievements. Oh dear. We're getting to that stage. Okay. Yeah, 150 fans, that's all well and good. We've lost like 10,000 fans over the last couple of years. Oy, this isn't good. Alright, Grand Theft Walrus did shit. I mean, really, just not good. Oh, I just found a bug and we just released the bloody game. That's not good. There's a bug in the game at launch. Full motion video, whatever. Get on vacation, you. Okay, the Welder Scrolls 3. Oh, no. No, 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 no. This is going to kill the company. This is going to be the end of the company. I don't want this to be the end of the company. Son of a bitch. Come on. Oh, fuck. Is it because I'm not promoting the game? Because I can't do that now. Ugh, let's find some publishing work. Um, any RPG, any post-apocalyptic strategy game for anything. We can't afford to make it, is the thing. Let's develop a new game. It's going to be a small... Um, you know what? Let's just do some research. The Welder Scrolls 3 should keep us afloat for a little bit. Martial Arts. Now oh, there's the M-Box finally released. Do some research into werewolves. Do some research into... Government. Okay, I'm determined to keep this company afloat. I am determined that it will not die horribly. Okay. So now you can do some research into transport. You can research mystery. And when you get finished, you can research something else as well. We are not making enough money to keep this company afloat. I have just realized that. Right. So research cyberpunk. Research. Okay, right. You know what we need to do? We need to develop a cheap game for everyone. So we'll make a... What will we make? A martial arts action strat... No. We'll make a... I will make we'll make a movie action strategy game. I No, you know what? Let's make a movie action game with I don't know. I don't know how the multiple genre thing works now. I You know what? I'm going to jump in and risk. We'll, we'll have a risk here. This will be adventure, action adventure game. 
on the play system 2 using our engine it'll be a mature game and it'll be called let me let me think of some movies that are action adventure we'll just call it the poor hmm i don't know a movie now we'll call it movie the game okay 100k to make this this is risky if movie the game doesn't work for us we are boned let's not have it we'll have a linear story why not gameplay is a big focus story and questing not so much well i'll put the engine down there Okay, right, we're not making enough money. We're not doing that. We're in the red. This could kill the company or make the company. It's going to be one or the other, and I am bloody scared to find out which. I don't want a level editor. We don't need AI companions. Let's so bring AI down a bit. No need for all that much dialogue. Come on, make me a shit ton of money. I swear, movie the game better just work like magic. No need for open world or anything like that. Bring that down, put that up. Okay. Right. Oh, God. Agree. We've been bailed out by the bank. But we need to pay them back over a million in a year's time. Right. Movie the game. It matches trends. It's a great cut. It's a new combo. It's a new topic. Voiceover and simple body language. So is movie the game. Is it going to be a thing? I'm quite worried. No. Looks at movie the game. Well, in 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 line with video games based on movies, it would seem that movie the game is in fact shit. Ay, that's not even going to make enough to keep us afloat. No. Nope. That's, that's not even enough, so what do we do? We have enough to make another game. We, a sports RPG with good royalties, targeting young people. You know what? We'll do it. A sports RPG, targeting young people, called Young Sport Hero. No, <laughs> Young Sport Herp. There we go. Young Sport Herp. <laughs> okay. Young Sport Herp. We'll go with that. Because what are the balls not? We'll use our latest engine. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't believe that. All right, we'll put me on gameplay, or maybe me there, or there. All right, me there. Joe can work. I'll go in there. All right. Gamepad support, simple cutscenes, no linear story. Okay, bring gameplay down a little bit. Story and quests down to there. Actually, we'll put a lot of time in the gameplay. There we go. Okay. So this is going to be it, ladies and gentlemen. This game will either make or break CN Studios. This will, this will be it. This will either make or break the company. And I don't know which. Alright. Level editor. We don't need a dialogue tree. Alright, level design down a little bit. Have good AI. It's a sports game. It needs good AI. 
Okay. This had better work. Okay, what do we want? I will work on graphics. We'll get Joe working on the sound and Jalen can work there. Okay. Doesn't need a rich backstory. Okay, so... Right, movie, the game, did shit. Let's see if young sport herp will do anything. We're in the red again. So we need to finish this game and get it out there before... before we are just out of money completely and... Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't care. I don't care. Just sell the bloody game. Sell the game! No, no! Fuck. That's the end of the company. That is the end of CN Studios. I have spent the last hour and ten minutes running this company into the ground. Oh, Jesus Christ. Unfortunately, I am bankrupt. We just got confirmation that CN Studios, which has been in financial trouble lately, has gone bankrupt. It appears that Electronic Mass Productions, a beam of the fuck's sake, EA Games, uh, purchased the remains of the company. A spokesperson said, we are very excited to have acquired the rights to all of CN Studios' previously released titles. Hearing the news, many fans of CN Studios have expressed their disappointment. This is the end of your journey. You can either load a saved game, restart this level, or start a new game. Well, I'm going to leave it up to you guys that watch this series. Do you want me to start over, or is this the end? Is this the end of Game Dev Tycoon? You tell me. And if we have a decision in, say, a couple of days after this video is uploaded... We will, we will see what happens. You decide, will we continue, will we try again, or will we call it a day? I've been the Conflict Nerd, I just ran my company into the ground, and I'll see you next time.